Good evening, everyone. This is Robert Stevens. Now I am doing your business report made possible by Amtrak. The way to get it, the best way to get them between Washington and Boston. And it's a Cell Express. Okay, and now we're going to take a look at Wall Street today. And, uh, yeah, with stock send it mixed today. The Dow Jones will end it today. Up. Up barely 2.82, less than three points at to end at 16,945.92. Ooh, almost threatening to hit the 17,000 barrier, by the way. SP 500 almost about to hit the 2,000 barrier. 1950.79 was the close today. Down a fraction, down almost half a point. FTSE 100 also lost. Lost to dot 1.45 to end at 68.73. Nikkei ended down and then 29 points to 14.995. And light sweet crude and and it's now selling for 104 dollars and 28 cents a barrel. Uh, Nasdaq, by the way, ended up 43.38, up 1.1 and 75 points. So, that's just that. And now we go to gas prices related to crude oil. Lowest around this uh, sales in Holbrook, 385 South Franklin Street, right on Route 37. Reported at 3.40 a gallon, so that's something. Route 18 Superstore, another local area. At 3.51 a gallon. So yeah, it's not that, so yeah, they're actually doing good. Gas prices are heading a bit down. And that one now. <coughs> and I guess that concludes your nightly report. The Red Sox, that concludes your business report. And I have to say the Red Sox were rain delayed. Hopefully they'll come out of their winners tonight. And with that, it's time for me to call it a night, so I'll see you later. And hopefully, the weather will cooperate for this weekend. I got high school softball to cover tomorrow at Taunton High School. So, I will see you at, you will be seeing my reports from Trip Field as I do the D2 Girls EMAS Final between Bellingham and Tewksbury. Bellingham... This is their second state final all time. First one in four years. We wish Bellingham the best of luck.